and I am in French Polynesia. I will be exploring the islands of Bora Bora, Morea, and Tahiti, but before we get started, make sure you like and subscribe to Jet Setter's channels to always be up to date with the latest travel trends. Now let's go have some fun. About to leave, already packing, come with me, I'm not really asking, we'll get away. To a place where we don't know It's my first time in Bora Bora. This place has been on my bucket list for years. I cannot believe I'm finally here. And I can't wait to bring you guys to explore with me. Let's go. I just took an eight and a half hour flight from Los Angeles to Tahiti and another 45 minute flight to reach Bora Bora. But it was so worth it. off a very windy boat ride but arrived at the Four Seasons. This is my first time here and I have no words. Fresh mango juice upon arrival. Thank you. Honestly, I've been to a lot of places in this world. I have never been anywhere like this before. Absolute paradise. Oh my god, please turn the camera right now. I haven't even seen my room yet. We just got in and I'm just taking a quick walk around just to see what everything looks like. Look at this. This is just like the picture perfect epic moment. Should I pose? How do I look? I need to give you a tour of this place because it's literally insane so it's almost like an apartment i have a living area right behind me you have a bathroom with a beautiful beautiful bathtub and everything just feels so open and big and then you walk through and then this is my bedroom this bed has the most epic view i've ever seen in my life when i wake up in the morning see the beautiful mountain right in front of me it's just unbelievable i can't even explain it i'm in heaven So pretty. I felt like I had to get flowers in my hair. I'm about to put on a swimsuit and wander the beaches of beautiful Bora Bora. I am about to take this baby out. Look at what's behind me. Absolute paradise. It's a little windy today, so let's see if my weak arms can handle it. Let's go. So much fun. It's harder than it looks though. Come on, Wynn, work with me. The water's so clear you can see fish swimming by me. in Bora Bora. There are sharks all around this boat. I'm about to jump in. Don't worry, they're friendly. I'm so excited. It's just so cool because you know that they're not going to hurt you and the water is crystal clear and you're just surrounded by stingrays and sharks. It's just unreal. Whoa! Look how big that one is. Wow. Oh my god, there's another one. with stingrays and sharks and we just pulled up for some lunch but I'm hungry I built up an appetite 
Let's go. I'm here with the executive chef of the Four Seasons in Bora Bora, Lander. Hey. And he just brought all the ingredients to make Poison Cru, which is the traditional local dish from Bora Bora, right? Exactly. So it's made with tuna, coconut milk, uh, lime juice, and then vegetables we can find. Today it will be red onions, carrots, and uh, cucumber. It's a really simple dish. And the first thing we're gonna do is salt it. We'll put a little bit salt to it. Just a little thing to know, they used to drown it a little bit in the sea, just to have, have the, the, the salt taste. The salt from the sea. So now, okay. if you want to help me, we can add the lime juice. Okay. Perfect. Okay. And I'm pouring the coconut milk. Oh, it's very creamy. So next thing we're going to do is add the vegetables. Really simple. And it's nice because they basically pick whatever vegetables are the freshest for the day, right? Yeah. You just mix it up. All right. Let's have it taste. taste it. Mm. It's very citrusy. You can taste the acidity from the lime and then the creaminess and sweetness of the coconut mixed together. Mm -hmm. It's a good combo. Oh my gosh, I can eat this whole bowl. Thank you for making this dish for me. What better setting to eat this in than just right here. This helicopter just landed on the helipad at the Four Seasons Hotel to pick us up for a private helicopter tour over Bora Bora. This is going to be insane. It's going to be probably the best views you can get of Bora Bora. So, let's go. an experience of a lifetime and I think one of the best ways to see Bora Bora from up high oh it was just the views were breathtaking it was so exhilarating just being on a tiny helicopter and just flying over and seeing the beautiful colors of the water oh I feel so blessed right now to be able to have experienced that <music> Sadly leaving the Four Seasons, but our trip is not over yet because we're heading to Morea. Island hopping is pretty simple in French Polynesia, and getting from Bora Bora to Morea was just a quick 45 minute flight. I just arrived at the Hilton Morea and it is beautiful. What I love about it is that it's so lush. The green water, the green mountains. I just thought I'd wear something orange so I can pop. It's really a photographer's dream. I can't wait to show you. Let's go explore. This is the deck of my overwater bungalow at the Hilton and today is Perfect. There's no wind and the water is like glass. So beautiful. There's lots of activities you can do in French Polynesia and one of them is you can take a catamaran out to all the beautiful lagoons in Morea and it's so beautiful today. It's sunny, no wind, perfect day for a boat. for one day so I had to come and explore a local market they make everything from seashell necklaces to grass skirts so many goodies and of course some yummy foods all right so I'm about to try this french fry sandwich all right let's give it a try first of all the fries are cold which is kind of like I'm a little disappointed about that the chicken has good flavor the sauce is like almost like a barbecue sweet teriyaki sauce and then there's mayo so it's basically just chicken mayo french fries and like a barbecue sauce so it's good 
But I wish the fries were warm, but I'm still gonna eat it. I'm hungry. <laughs> All right, so I just got a flower crown and a flower necklace, fresh from the local market. She's making it literally right here. Can't get fresher than this, and we are heading to the beach. I really hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, hit the like button and subscribe to Jet Setter's channel. And if I've inspired you to travel to French Polynesia, head over to jetsetter.com to learn more. Nana!